everyone. Uh, as you can see, I look ridiculous. I'm wearing my Rhinocorn hoodie, which means only one thing. I'm going to be reading Rhinocorn Rules, which is a book about very special rhinoceros. So let's go. Ron looked the same as any other rhinoceros. He was big, he was grey, and he had a pointy thing on the top of his nose. But Ron felt different. Now Ron knew the three rhino rules. Rule one, be alone. Rule two, be a bit grumpy. And rule three, charge at anything that comes near you. Get out of me way! But Ron didn't like the rules very much. He loved fun, art, laughter and music. He was just bursting with ideas and joy. That's all the stuff in Ron's head there, as you can see. He's got a lot going on. Ron wanted to share this with everyone, but because he was a rhino, none of the other animals would go near him. And when he did meet up with another rhino, they didn't want to chat. They just wanted a charge. Life wasn't much fun for poor Ron, until one hot afternoon at the watering hole, when he looked at his grey reflection in the water. If only I could show everyone my true colours, he thought, then I'd be sure to make friends. This gave Ron a great idea. First, he rolled around in the dust until he was completely covered in it. Next, he gathered berries and leaves and smooshed them up to make different colours. And then he got creative. It was very messy, but it was great fun. The sticky colours soon dried in the hot sun. Ron was a walking work of art. He felt amazing. The meerkats were the first to notice Ron. Instead of running away, they all gathered around him. They were very impressed by this colourful new animal. Are you a unicorn? asked one of the meerkat pups. Ron thought about it for a moment. Um, no, I'm a rhinocorn. The other animals were very excited to meet Ron. He made lots of new friends and had lots of fun. For the first time in his life, Ron was happy. But word of Ron the Rhinocorn soon spread and the other rhinos weren't at all happy. Ron is making us look silly. It's got to stop. They came from far and wide to find out what on earth was going on. This is ridiculous. You're embarrassing us. I agree. Me too. Ron felt terribly sad. All he wanted was to make friends and have fun. Now he just felt silly for breaking the rhino rules. But Ron's new meerkat pals were having none of it. As long as you're happy with who you are, that's all that counts. The brave little meerkat stood up for Ron and made a very good point. Look at you, all together and all getting on with each other. They laughed. Looks like you've all broken the rhino rules. It slowly dawned on the other rhinos that they had broken their own rules. One by one they started to laugh. You're right, they agreed. We have enjoyed hanging out together. I think it's time we had some new rules, said Ron. And he ripped up the rhino rule book. It wasn't that difficult actually because it's very thin. And so Ron created three much better rules for everyone to follow. Rule one, be yourself. Rule two, make lots of friends. And rule three, have fun. And that's exactly what they did. Woohoo! Right accord rules! That's the, that's the end of Rhino Corn Rules. And now for some Rhino Facts. That's a fact, by the way. Did you Rhino? Rhinos don't get together much, but when they do, it's called a crash. 
Even though rhinos are huge, they are herbivores, and they only feed on grass and plants. Rhino horns are made from the same thing as your fingernails. Hmm, interesting. The word rhinoceros means nose horn. And finally... Male rhinos mark out their territory with poo. And that concludes the rhino facts. Thanks for watching. Bye.